Noel Insiders Chalk Talk here with quarterback Sean McGuire. Sean, today we're going to talk about calling an audible. At, at what point in your career is that something you felt comfortable doing at the line of scrimmage? Uh, you know, it's something that we're taught, obviously, when we're young, uh, especially to make set adjustments when blitzes are coming. Uh, you know, it takes a couple times, you know, obviously to get used to it without even thinking about it. Uh, go ahead and let's uh, get to the board. Just put up a play. I'll say we got a two rider protection, which is a six man protection. Say if we just had a normal play call, what we call Seattle, which is which is three verticals, and then uh, back check them down right here. So we would declare Mike right on this, which is the line would be responsible. These four would be responsible for the four down linemen and the Mike, and the back will have first pass right here. So. What we call was, you know, obviously always people on the stands always see us pointing out and everything, and you know sometimes people might not know, but it's for you know if a strong safety's coming down or something in the box, and all of a sudden we realize that since we got two rod or six man protection, which was sliding to the mic, we can't handle one pass the mic to the side away from the back, so we would you know give a double point that way, which would say would tell the receivers right these two guys you know they point back make sure that the uh, it gets communicated, and if the, if the strong safety comes and the mic blitzes, instead of running these verticals, which would take a long time to get to, we know we would sight adjust and run something. He would stay on a vertical. He would, depending on the week or the game plan and the type of defenses uh, we face to blitzes, it would either be uh, what we call a hawk route, which is a four step out, or you know we'd get like a double slant type concept. So that's pretty much uh, how to get to get to a sight adjustment. When you have a bunch of veteran receivers out there, is it you guys are on the same page on this yeah, pretty much right a, away? It's a, it's a lot easier, obviously, uh, you know, with guys like Travis, and Bobo, and Rudolph who've been out there and, uh, and seen it. So, you know, it's a lot easier with them. All right, well, thanks for taking time with us today, Sean. No problem. We'll see you next time with Chalk Talk.